Hey everybody, this is Melvin with Tech Running 24-7. And in today's video, we want to share with you how to airdrop with the iPhone XS Max in the new iOS 12.1. So for demonstration purposes, we're going to use our iPhone XS here. And to airdrop, what we need to do is locate the uh, control center so we can turn a few things on. So to get to the control center, just swipe from the bottom right hand corner down and it'll put you into the control center. Once you're in the control center, you just need to make sure that your Bluetooth is on and your Wi-Fi. So this is our Bluetooth is turned on and our Wi-Fi is turned on. But also we need to make sure that the airdrop uh, is selected. And so to get there, you just need to press here in the middle of that menu, press a little harder, and it will take you to a new menu to where it says airdrop. And so as you see, it, it is lit up with airdrop to everyone. Now, if you were to press a little harder, you will see the other selections that you can choose. You can actually turn the receiving off or say airdrop to contacts only or to everyone. In this case, we will select everyone just in case the person we're trying to airdrop to is not in our contacts. And so if you press under that menu, it will take you back to the control center. And then if you press underneath that, it will take you back to your home page. Now what we want to do is airdrop a photo to another Apple device. And so the other Apple device we want to airdrop to is another iPhone. And so we have an iPhone 7 we want to use as part of this demonstration. And we're going to set that right there. And so also to keep in mind, when you airdrop, you need to also make sure that the other iPhone has the Bluetooth turned on and the Wi-Fi and the AirDrop has been selected as everyone also. So go ahead and open up your photos in your iPhone 10 here. Uh, tap on that to open and uh, go ahead and select a photo. So I'm gonna select this Apple here. And if you look at the bottom of the screen right there, you will see this particular symbol. Go ahead and tap on that. And once you tap on that, that selects that Apple photo to be sent. And if you look closely, the uh, Apple devices that you can airdrop to that's within, within range are the uh, iPhone 7 Plus, Melvin's iPhone 7 Plus, and Melvin's MacBook Pro. So we want to airdrop to the iPhone 7 Plus. And so to airdrop to it, you just tap on that icon right there. And as you can see, it says waiting. And if we set this down for a second to pick up our iPhone 7, you will see that it's popped up to say airdrop and hit decline or accept. So we're going to hit accept. And so once you hit accept, that photo has been sent to the iPhone 7. And if you look, you see that I, the uh, photo is also on the iPhone 10. I'm going to set the iPhone 7 back down for a second there. And uh, that photo has been sent. So all you have to hit is done. And you have successfully sent a photo by airdropping it from your device. So that's about it for our video for today. How to airdrop with the iPhone 10 S Max in the new iOS 12.1. So hopefully we shared something that you can use and something that was beneficial. Now, if this is your first time visiting our channel, or if you've been here before but hadn't subscribed, we wanted to encourage you to go ahead and take a moment real quick and uh, hit that subscribe button down below. Now, while you're at it, go ahead and hit that bell icon too, so you can be notified of new content as soon as we release it. And again, this is Melvin with Tech Running 24-7 bringing you technology that's on the move. Thanks.